boys and girls. And welcome to Social Studies. You know, the funny thing about Indiana is that a few years back, Indiana decided that they wanted to be a little bit different from other states. We have these things called standards, and that means there are certain things that we think that kids your age should know. And most of the rest of the United States decided to all have the same standards, but Indiana decided that they wanted theirs to be different. And for that reason, you actually have two social studies books. And when they make a book like this, they don't really know how the teacher wants to teach the order. So sometimes they're not going to start at the beginning, we're not gonna start at the beginning and go to the end straight through. And because we have two different ones, sometimes we look at it in two different ways. And so today for social studies, I want you to get this book out, the My World book. Now, if you look where I'm at, I'm about right in the middle. And I'm on page 84, and 84 is called Where We Live. It says that some words tell relative location. And then it has relative location in yellow. That means that's a word that we think you should know, or those are words that we think you should know. Relative location is where something is compared to something else. The words near, far, left, right, behind and in front of tell about relative location. So if you look at the picture, here's a little girl. The girl is near the fishbowl. She is in front of the boy. The boy is far from the girl. He is behind her. The fishbowl is to the right of the plant. The flag is to the left of the boy. Those are some words that you are expected in kindergarten to know. You should know that near means close to and far means not close to. It's the opposite. It means that I'd have to go a little ways to get to that thing. We also should know our rights and our lefts. Now, because I'm looking at you, my right is here, if I am you, and my left is over here. If I make an L with my hand, and I look at it, and it's not backwards, this is my left hand. See, if I make it my L with my right hand, it looks backwards. So if I can make the L and it's facing the right way, that's the left. On page 86, it says where some families live. Some families like to live near a harbor, and harbor is yellow. And it says a harbor is a body of water next to a shore. Harbors keep boats safe from strong winds and waves. Boats bring things you can buy. You can have fun in a harbor. See, they're kayaking. It says, look at the picture. Circle something behind the blue kayak. Well, what is behind the blue kayak? The yellow. So I'm going to circle the yellow kayak because it is behind the blue kayak. Places can change over time. A harbor's water might get too low. People could not fish or boat in it. Some families would have to move to new places. So why might a family have to move to a new place? Well, if the water gets too low, they can't fish your boat in it. Now, I want you down here, it says to draw a picture of your classroom and to show your relative location. Now, your classroom is in your home right now. So draw a picture right here of where you work on your schoolwork. And then I want you to draw an X where you sit to work on your schoolwork. So if you're in your kitchen at the table, draw a picture of your kitchen with your table and put an X where you would sit to work. 
Then I want you to tell somebody in your home what is good about it and what's bad about it. You know, maybe the place that you work is not the best place. Maybe it's too noisy. Or maybe it's a good place because it's a quiet place. What's good and what's bad about the place where you work? What's something that's near you when you're working? What's something that's far when you're working? Think about those questions. Now we will be continuing to work in here because we're gonna go over the globes and maps section tomorrow or Tuesday. So go ahead and stick, after you're finished, stick your um, bookmark or a piece of paper in there. So remember that we started on page 84 today, about the middle of the book, 84. And I know that's hard to find, so thank you for working so hard to get to it.